the doubles title together. It's the first time that you've played together this year. I am very excited. I'm sure Kata excited as well. It's uh, first tournament, it's always tough because after a long break, you have to focus, you have to make sure you do the right things. And uh, I think we played very, very well throughout this week. Very consistent. We beat very good double teams. And uh, I think we proved today in the, in the finals, beating the number one team that uh, we're ready, hopefully, for big things this year. Was that an expectation coming into the week that you wanted to win or you just wanted to sort of get used to playing with each other again? I mean, the first tournament of the year, you, 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 you look step by step, you know, you don't look too far ahead uh, because you don't know where your form is, uh, you have a long off season, you train well, you know, you fit and ready, you know that, and that you've done your homework, but uh, a match is a match, you know, and it's always uh, uh, another story. And, um, but like I said, we had a very, very tough draw and every match was a uh, tough opponents and from match to match we played even better and gave us more um, confidence and more, um, uh, um, I say not proof, but like um, we, we got confirmation that we sure. are a strong partnership and you know, it's, it's a really good thing for us to win this and with the first tournament and now going yeah. with a lot of confidence to Melbourne for sure. What about Sydney? For both of you, you've been on tour for a while, you're veterans. What are, what's special about Sydney to the two of you? I mean, it's just it's just an, a lovely city. I, I don't know, I just always feel good here, um, always play good. And for me, I'm the type of person where I feel good, I play well. And uh, Sydney is, I think, for many players, one of the favorite the uh, uh, cities. The hotel is right in the heart of the city, and you can go around and do something so it's just it's just nice I absolutely agree with that I am cool all right so a few fun questions I'll Google ask first. I'll ask Nadia okay. about Katarina oh. and vice versa okay, okay. all right I Nadia. don't think we're careful <laughs> I don't think we're gonna succeed on those questions I'll be like punching <laughs> you in here. Nadia in what year did Katarina win the junior Wimbledon singles title junior Wimbledon what year what year I have to do math now. <laughs> do you want to? Don't do it out loud though. Just do it in your head. No, I think it'll be earlier. I'd say uh, 95. What do you say? Eight. Ninety-eight. Oh, ding, ding, ding. That's okay. I'm not that old. Okay. <laughs> I thought you wanted when you were very young. All right, Katerina, your turn. Uh, what is Nadia's current single ranking? 13. Ding, ding. No, uh, wrong. 12. Oh, you sold her short. 13. <laughs> oh, no. Uh -uh. All right. <laughs> what sorry. is, Nadia, what is Katarina's older sister's name? I even didn't know that she had a sister. I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm keeping my privacy. She is <laughs> very good <laughs> with her <laughs> privacy. No. no, we were so busy playing. We yes. didn't have time to catch exactly. up with those things. <laughs> Do you want to tell her her name? Like it would matter. Urshka. Urshka. All right. Next time, remember that. Okay. <laughs> uh, Katerina, what did Nadia's mother win a medal for at the 1976 Montreal Olympics? Oh, this is something I should know. <laughs> Running. <laughs> Specifically? <laughs> <laughs> Nadia, you tell her. Uh, relay, 4x400 four four meters. Oh, all right, let's see if we can nail one. Uh, what player, maybe growing up or, or coming up, did Katarina admire most? A woman's player. Tough. I'm just going to say Steffi Graf because Katarina has the same style. Oof. We are think just of, <laughs> think of the worst <laughs> partnership ever. We know nothing about each other. Yeah, think of Steffi's arch rival. I, I think we should start spending more who time is, off court. Steffi's the rival, the biggest rival, Steffi and Celes. Yes. There you go. Monica. <laughs> Maybe I'll right. try to get one for I, the team. I, I think you can get this one. In 2010, Nadia hit the most aces on the women's tour. How many, many did she how hit? Should I know. Yes, how many? Wait, let me it remember. It was very close to the remember. amount of the days in a year. <laughs> where was go. it? Then just tell me where was it. Huh? Where was Do it? Do you remember? Wait, well, well, sorry, was it of the year or of the, the year? The whole, so the whole, whole year. year. So yeah. at the end of the, let's say, Moscow? No, no, no. How many days in a year? 
it was how many days <laughs> how many aces in a year is it <laughs> <laughs> what's the question i'm trying to give you a tip she's trying to give you a hint hint ah, ah. So, so do you that's remember what it is? Though. So 365 aces. I think it was 363. Yeah, they have 306 online. Yeah. So So that's close. That's 300. Yeah. It's a lot of aces. <laughs> oh, what's wrong with you? Why were you so mean? Okay, Nadia, I hope you know this one, but maybe not. Um, what is Katarina's birthday? March 12th. Ding, ding, ding. 81. Oh, <laughs> yes. Yes. Oh. She told me recently. Yes. That's why I remembered. Good memory. <laughs> um, all right, Katarina, what did Nadia's father do, probably do, he probably doesn't do this anymore, for a living? What was his career? What did Jimmy do? Hmm? <laughs> he was, I know that. Easy. He was a coach. He was Nadia's first coach. We'll, we'll give yes. it to you. He's a athletic coach, but he was uh, <laughs> fitness coach. Exactly, that's, that's right. <laughs> yeah. Well done, ladies. Solid effort. Next time we'll do better.